Okay, so I'm just sad because I'm technically challenged right now, technologically challenged, and I just recorded like five minutes of a video already, and then like my computer flipped, and it just So I'll just restart. Hello, everyone. Um, I very much enjoyed all of your videos this past week. They've been entertaining and also wonderful to know about all the things that have been going on in my life. Um, let's see. Um, where am I going to start? Oh, sorry. I'm going to start from last Friday. Sorry, it's going to last Friday. I couldn't do a class about it. So I went to the Imagine Dragons concert. And it was probably the best concert I've experienced thus far. Um, it was just, and probably the best that I'll experience for a little while because they, oh, um, they were so awesome. I knew every word to the song that they were singing except for one that they haven't released yet. So I knew, I, I think that's what made, like, made it the best concert that I've been to because I can sing along to everything. I just like, oh, the energy that they poured, that they, oh, they were so amazing. So, I can't even describe it. But, Tiana, you should be really excited. You should be really excited. I know I was, I know. If you saw the pictures on Facebook, I made the shirt, and it had, like, a mashup. First, on the on the top, it was a mashup, and I took one line from every song from the Night Visions album, and mashed it all up together in, like, a top thing, and tried to make it make sense. It didn't always work, but I mean, song words. Anyway, and then I took four different songs from that album, and oh, took a lot of work, but it was worth it. And, holy shit, the concept was and the moshing, holy crap, like it wasn't like, it was just like, you know, just like a, but it was like, whoosh, jumping off the floor, like energy, and the surround, and the people, and just like, oh, it was great, it was wonderful. And Dan, I think his name is, the singer for Imagine Dragons, he was just like, when he performed, he was so passionate about every song, like every word he said, like, no, but it's amazing. And, oh my god, he was talking about his friend Tyler, who lived in Utah, who died recently. And he started crying. He was, oh, so thank you so much. You love me, Oh my god. And then he sang this song that, that the one that hasn't been released yet, and it was beautiful. So, so gorgeous. So, so Tiana, be excited for that, because they are amazing. So that was so much on Friday, and then Saturday, I got to go help out with the violin thing, that was fun, I got to see my brother perform, he was great, he's been practicing a lot, I can tell, which is awesome, I'm very proud of him, oh, I need to tell you guys this, because it's cute, and it makes me really happy, apparently, I didn't, I didn't notice this while he was performing, but after Eric, like, while Eric was performing, my dad, <laughs> Oh my god, my mom told me that. I was just like, oh. I love that Um, yeah, so that happened. And then, then I went to Sushi and got pictures with Diana and Yaya. I know everybody's to the pillows. <laughs> Sorry, I already got Um, yeah, that was such a glorious day to spend my Saturday. Um, that's so much fun. And now, god. I'm such a fuck though, Tiana knows this, but I got my pedicure done, and <laughs> as we're walking out the back of the car, I hit it with the door, so I ruined the pedicure that the man who was learning how to do pedicure stuff painstakingly spent time on, and oh, I felt bad, but then it did, so that would happen. Um, but it still looks beautiful, it's just the one toe, but it, yeah, and Anyway, um, then I was really tired because I haven't gotten any good sleep the past, like, month or so. Like, I'm not even excited. But, a lot of it's due to my fault, so I shouldn't even complain. Anyway, so I had to go get coffee, and I got a coffee with a shot of espresso in it, so it's like, coffee, 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 coffee. And it really 
really affects me, the espresso part, because you want to witness this, but I just went, a little cray cray. I'm going to cray cray. I was like, this was me before the coffee. I was like, can I get a tub? Can I have you espresso? Oh, no. And then I, like, got it, and I, like, spilled a little bit, and the was like, what the hell's wrong with you? And then I drank it. And not, not even kidding me, like five minutes later, to be honest, can I test for me? Like five, five minutes? Yeah. <laughs> like literally, I was in the car just looking at the like, <laughs> I was going crazy, and Dion was like, that shit really affects you. Holy crap. Holy crap, home mail. And so, yeah, that was fun. And then she dropped me off at my dorm, and I went to see Warm Body. Bye. This concludes friends. It was awesome. It was very fun. And then we were going to watch a Harry Potter senior year, which is like a musical parody thing of Harry Potter. It's glorious. Glorious. Um, but Courtney, my friend Courtney had some family issues that we had to, that we were going to try to help her sort out. Um, her mom's a psycho bitch. Anyway. Anyway. Um, let's see. What else happened? Oh, sorry for swearing. Oh. Um, Sunday. What happened last Sunday? God, I don't remember. Oh, I went. Basically, had a. Uh, oh, I went home. My mom made better, better nut squash pancakes. So I was like, I need mean, some of those before I went and got them. And, oh my gosh, so delicious. Every time I go home, I just like. Oh. Yeah. Um, so that was fun. And then I came back and I went to an REPA meeting where we talked about our Harry Potter thing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, I need to speed this up, guys. Monday, um, was my busy day. I had fun because I, I always have fun on Mondays. Um, but nothing super special happened. Tuesday, um, that was when all the gay rights stuff was happening, I remember. And I was like, what's this equal sign? And then my gay friend was telling me about it. Um, and later that day, I went to a protest at the Capitol because, um, because there was this event going on for, it was like a fundraising event for traditional marriage, and I was like, are you really going to do that today? Like, really? And so there were just tons of people who gave out who were there to sign and stuff, and like, saying, there's a girl in the now, and I was like, yes, perfect. Yes, 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 yes. That was fun. I was like, Okay. Um, and then Wednesday. Wednesday was fun because she is down for the weekend. So I got to meet yesterday and we hung out at the park and we walked around and we came to the bar, the cafe, and we played cats and stuff and climbed some trees and had adventure time. It was so much fun. And then, we, let's see, we went to dinner, okay. um, I decided what I'm living next year, so that'll be fun, and there's this house that the critics kids are renovating, and it's going to be $300 a month, so it's going to be really, really nice, it's like 50 minutes away from school, by bus, so it's kind of like, but, that's a really good thing. And living in a credit card, I'm excited to live there. It'll be fun. So that's good that I figured that out. Um, so that happened yesterday. Today, I went to classes and I saw Steve again. He basically, like, we just hung out and explored downtown Salt Lake. And that was great. And then I went and saw the host. I was a pretty noble Pinkwood friend. Pinkwood friend I went to see one body with. So it's been a fun week. I'm going to end this video with some video now. Alright, I hope you guys all have a great, wonderful, lovely week. I will see you all in the end of on Saturday at the Holy Festival. And Tiana and Amanda, I hope you have a wonderful afternoon. Love you all. Sorry, this video is going to be fun.